Welcome to Ganjinit. Today again we are back with five important events which happened in last one or two days. And we will not only talk about the events, we will also talk about the uh, facts in our info box, some data, some information regarding those events. Uh, but before going to that, uh, here uh, to announce that we are very soon coming up with the uh, some series on Indian national movement and also on my India. So this will come in uh, various parts. We hope you like those series. Uh, it will be useful for competitive exam as well as as well as for the school students also. So please uh, like, subscribe and comment in our YouTube channel. As you already know that we are also on Facebook and Instagram. So you would like to see more of your comments. So today we'll cover news on an event which will be against the glass ceiling. Second one is NASA's mission. So what NASA is going to do? Then third is the Rhino conservation. Fourth is an amendment which has been recently passed in the parliament. And fifth is the about the youngest Emmy awardee. So let's start. The first one first omen airborne tacticians who will operate from deck of warships sub lieutenant kumudini tyagi sub lieutenant riti singh both of them none of this and the right option is both of them so both of these ladies they selected for the helicopter stream before this entry of omen was restricted to fixed wing aircraft operating from inland bases. In mid 1990s, women from the Navy's logistics branch were deployed on warships, uh, but that was a very short lived experiment. Still, tanks and combat positions in the infantry still no go zones for women. Some of the chronicle events of uh, the omen advancement 1992 omen were allowed to join the armed forces outside the medical stream for first time 1999 flight lieutenant gunjan saxena and sribidya rajan became the first omen officers to fly helicopters in the kargil war zone 2005 military doctor punita arora became the first omen to reach the three star rank 2018 flying officer Avani Chaturvedi became the first IAF woman to undertake a historic solo sortie in a MiG-21 Bison. 2019 Sub Lieutenant Sivangi became the first woman pilot in the Navy. Let's move to the question 2. NASA revealed a plan to return astronauts to the moon under the mission Space 2. Luna 3, Apollo 4, Artemis 2. And right option is Artemis 2. Artemis is a is NASA's program, is an ambitious program. Uh, NASA earlier proposed a plan to return humans to the moon by 2028, but now they have shifted to 2024 and this is after the apollo lunar mission in 1972 so what is artemis so artemis 1 is the uncrewed test flight in 2021 artemis 2 is the crewed mission in august 2023 so first human will go artemis 3 second crewed mission in october 2024 landing the first astronauts on the lunar south pole 
So, so again, Artemis 1 is uncrewed, Artemis 2 is crewed mission in August 2023 and Artemis 3 is the second crewed mission in October 2024. Estimated cost is $28 billion. So there is a NASA's uh, new rocket, there's a very powerful rocket that is the Space Launch System, SLS, and the Orion spacecraft are closer than ever to their first integrated launch. So they have been getting ready for this mission. Third one, World Rhino Day is celebrated on September 24, September 22, September 29, September 15. Right option is September 22. This Rhino Day is celebrated for five species of Rhino, Sumatran, Black, Greater One Horned, Javan and White. What is the root of this Rhino crisis? So there is a myth that Rhino horn contains curative properties. It is having mainly keratin. So this World Rhino Day, this highlights the efforts to debunk these myths and diminish the demand for Rhino horn. Of these five Rhino species, these are living in Africa and Asia, three are listed by the IUCN as critically endangered, Javan, Sumatran and Black. White Rhinos are considered near threatened and Greater One Horned Rhinos vulnerable to extinction. So all these five species are in danger. It, this World Rhino Day was first announced by World Wildlife Fund WWF in 2010. Out of these five species, Sumatran Rhino is most at threat. Its population declined by more than 70% in the past 30 years. Rhinos are ancient. They are around for over 50 million years. They are much earlier in prehistoric times, but otherwise they have not evolved much. So there is an involvement from the famous player Kevin Peterson, the cricketer. On World Rhino Day, he featured in Save the Rhino India, a National Geographic documentary that exhibits his passion for rhino conservation. It also featured explorer Kriti Karant. So this has been uh, done, this, the shooting has been done in Kajiranga National Park. The fourth one is an amendment. The Banking Regulation Amendment Bill 2020 will ensure RBI monitoring on non-banking financial company, regional rural banks, cooperative banks, none of this. And right option is cooperative banks. This bill was passed in Rajya Sabha to bring cooperative banks under the supervision of RBI. It is actually to protect the interest of depositors. This legislation empowers RBI to regulate only the banking activities of cooperatives and it's not applicable on a primary agricultural credit society or a cooperative society providing finance for agricultural development. So does it, does it affect the existing power structure? No. These amendments do not affect the existing powers of the state registers of cooperative societies under state cooperative laws. Uh, this bill was earlier passed by the Lok Sabha on September 16. So now with the uh, with the passage of this bill in Rajya Sabha, so this will be in effect. There are different types of cooperative banks urban cooperative banks and rural cooperative banks. Further, these RCBs, that is the rural cooperative banks, are classified into state cooperative banks and district central cooperative banks. According to RBI, there were 1544 UCBs, 34 state CBs and 352 DC CBs. The last one is an Emmy Award. The youngest actress who made history with her Emmy win, Jennifer Aniston, Zendaya, Coleman, Jodie Comer, Olivia Coleman. And the right option is Zendaya Coleman. 
This American actress made Emmy's history when she became the youngest woman at the age of 24 to take home this award for Best Actress. She is only the second black woman Prior to her, the only black actress to win this award was Viola Davis in 2015. In 2010, uh, she was 14 years old when she landed a debut acting role as Rocky Blue on the hit Disney Channel show Shake It Up. Keep on watching and provide your feedback.